Hi guys, um, today I am basically just vlogging from my house uh, and I was kind of just rearranging my uh, vinyl. You can <clears throat> you can see some of it just over here. Woo, look at that. And we've got the second shelf as well. And then I thought, seeing as he can be sometimes a bit of a, a man behind the scenes, let's just say, uh, I thought that I would introduce you all to the one and only Mr. Rupert. Oh, he's currently stepping all over my laptop. Hello, Mr. How are you? Right. Now, Mr. Rupert, you shall play a very important part in today's video. For we shall be choosing two amazing albums. Is the decision. Oh, and we have Napalm Death as a winner. Oh, oh, oh maybe no. Nile, it's Nile. The results are in. It is Nile. Okay, now for round two, we have got Cynic, Traced in Air, and then Death's Human. So which will you choose, Rupert? My cat is also deaf. Which one? Neither. Rupert is being a little bit annoying and he's not coming over. So I thought what I would do is I put some dreamies in front of him. So let's see if it works. It appears he has chosen Cynic. I mean, that's where he's going to be eating his dreamies. There we go. So he knows that Cynic is today's winner. Round three. We've got the Black Dahlia murder versus cattle decapitation. Which one will he choose? Oh, here we go. Neither. Again. He has gone for cattle decapitation. The man clearly has impeccable choice. Oh, no, he could be that. <laughs> he, <laughs> he's adorable. Clearly, he knows his proper grindcore. Little fact, uh, this record I picked up when I went to see the band, um, and it's in limited edition gold. Round four. It appears, he has chosen Ghost. Ghost is his choice. Ghost because he also looks like a ghost. Round four. Okay, now it's time for the age-old debate of Crack the Sky or Blood Mountain. Which one will you pick, Ru? He has chosen Crack the Sky. And what a cracking choice that is. I mean, the competition between the two is very highly contested. Crack the Sky is pretty cool. Um, it's highly regarded as probably their most progressive record, but I really like Blood Mountain because of the way I think it kind of sticks to the story the most. Um, <clears throat> and you've got so many different sort of weird creatures in it, you know, like the Sisquatch, the Birchmen, folks. The, the biggest debate among metalheads ever, Megadeth or Metallica. <gasps> Who will you choose, Rupert? Who will you choose? Two thousand years later. Okay, who's he gonna choose? Look! Look! Who will you choose, Rue? Who will you choose? Look, Julius, look. And he has chosen Megadeth. Megadeth is the final winner. The age-old battle settled by a little snowy cat. So, there you have it, guys. Rupert has helped me choose uh, between 10 albums. I think it's 10. Um, What's he doing over there? He's trying to eat his dreamies, so I've got to go. But I hope you enjoyed uh, today's video and you've seen a little bit of my vinyl collection. Um, hopefully he hasn't ruined any of them. And uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next one. Peace out. <laughs>